okay, are we going to be able to get a spot or what? My bet is we're going to look out. What do you think? Maybe not because we have someone in front of us. I don't know, Bubby. These sights are looking pretty cool. Are you a sight? Stop. Okay, you are a sight, but you are like in front of everybody. So maybe not. Maybe we'll try to find something a, l a little bit more secluded. Are you a sight? <gasps> You are. All right, we're, hey guys. We're currently on the hunt for a campsite, if you haven't been able to tell. Not having the best luck. I'm seeing a few, but they're kind of out in the open, and I don't know how I feel about that. All right, we're gonna have to go back and take that one we just passed, Bubby, because there ain't no other options, child. That's okay. We only need to stay here for one night anyways, so. And we're only four hours away from bedtime, so. Honestly, not that big of a deal. We're gonna need to turn around here. Come on, Ruby. Now we'll see what happens. The pickle with Rue, you guys, is I don't have an e-brake. Doesn't work, doesn't do anything. So I have to park in first gear and then kind of hope Rue doesn't slide back. So far this seems all right. Oh, and it's raining. Cute. A little rain never hurt nobody. Oh. Are you gonna move, Rue? But we found a campsite. There's so much to be grateful for. We could have been stuck with no campsite. This was like one of two open ones. You know? This is like really exciting. I know. It's like a hot one today. Almost 80 degrees, which for Blue and I is like <sighs> illegal type of heat. You know what I'm saying? Like we don't do well in heat. We chase cold weather, especially this entire summer stretch. We will be chasing cold weather. So. We're going to get Rue ready for summer camping tonight. Because we're stuck in like 80 degrees. And there's nothing we can do about it tonight. Are you, Bubby? Are you okay? Are you rethinking your life? Me too. I'm gonna make food really quick because it's dinner time and your girl's hungry, so let's get to it. My buns were moldy, so plain burger it is. Hi, Bobby. There goes the thunder. 
We might be doing an evening walk in the rain tonight, Blue. Here come the storm clouds. Blue and I were just on our evening walk and I just passed this campsite that is totally free and has the prettiest views ever. Look at this. And it's way more secluded than where we're at right now. So a uh, change of plans. Blue and I are gonna go move root. <laughs> Bye. We gotta hurry back and move root before someone steals us. Where did you even find a ball? Drop. This campsite even has free tennis balls. <laughs> it's like they want us to move here or something. All right, look, come on, we gotta go get Rue. We gotta go get Rue, we gotta hurry. Sorry, bub. I know my computer's on the seat and stuff, but it's like a two minute drive, okay? Two minutes, it'll be fine. Let's get out of here. Holy crap, that campsite is way better. I love when stuff like this happens, which is why you should always stay positive when car camping, because even when stuff goes wrong, I feel like somehow it always ends up working out. Now, if I can just remember where it is, I think it's right here, right? Yeah? <laughs> cool campsite secured, Bubby. Heck, freaking yeah, dude. And it's flat, which is so nice because our other one, we were like on an incline. Heck yeah! Are you kidding me? Bubby, look at this view. Insane, right? Yeah. Okay, well, I really don't think it's going to rain. It's kind of tricky because the weather app, like every 20 minutes, is like rain expected in 40 minutes, and then it's like sunny. When you check again, no rain, and then it's like rain, and then it's no rain, and then rain, and then no rain, and then whiplash, you know? Snip, snap, snip, snap. So I'm going to make the executive decision to pretend like it's not going to rain. And the only reason I was holding off is because... Are you crooked right now? Sorry. I'm embarrassing. We are getting Rue summer proof today, so I'm just putting up a couple things that are going to help us with it starting to get a little bit hotter. And as much as we chase the cold temperatures, sometimes it's still 80 degrees like it is today, right? Yeah. So I got a few new things for Rue that are gonna help us stay cold at night and I'm very excited because we just need to make sure Bubby's comfortable, right? Yeah, who cares about me? It's all about you. So anyways, let's get Rue prepped for this summery night, shall we? First thing I got was a cover. How do I describe this thing? It's something that covers the hatch. Like if you open the trunk, it's pretty much like a screen that keeps bugs out. So I can have the trunk open all night and let like breeze come in, but not bugs. So let's see if this works.
How do you work? I don't get it. Um, where are the directions? Um, hmm. I think it attaches to the wheel. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. I may have broke half of it, but this isn't anything. Stop it. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, this summer is going to be so nice. Oh my gosh. Are you freaking kidding me? Let me show you guys. Okay, so it attaches to the wheels. The only thing I'm worried about is this. There's a little gap for bugs to get in. So I have some Gorilla Tape in my roof rack. I'm gonna try to tape the side down so it's flush. Because you guys know I'm deathly afraid of bugs so that we can't have that at night. But look at this. How cute, it's like totally open. So that's awesome. We'll be able to get like breeze and it'll be cool at night. But you can see that, you can see that gap through the side there. So that's the only thing I need to figure out how to fix. Blue, you want a ball? I think I packed too much stuff. I just like to be prepared for moments like this. All right, let's do this. I need to grab scissors first. Wow, that is so convenient. Entirely flush. Okay, let's go do the other side. Bobby, are you already destroying your tennis ball? Cute! What? Awesome! Oh my gosh! Blue, this is like an entirely new camping experience. Okay, I need you to take it seriously. I need you to be excited. No? Okay. Well, maybe next time. Die, mosquito. Oh, I just got that right in my eye. Right, let's get our other summer tools out, shall we? This is actually, like, surprisingly heavy. The next thing I got is... 
a self-cooling mat for Blue. I'm gonna put this right where he sleeps in the car and it'll keep him cooler than normal. It's like gel formula. It's like cushiony too. So it's just gonna go where Blue sleeps at night, keep him colder, which is like really all I care about. There's a view of the back with it open. I'm really excited about that. Last thing I got for when it's super hot at night. A battery powered fan. And it's got a freaking hook on it, dude. So I can hang this from the top of the roof and just get air all night. What? <laughs> We are set up well. We are set up well. Did you guys ever do that when you were kids? <laughs> so I'll put this in root tonight and probably put it on low. It's not like extremely hot. It was only 80 today. Um, obviously if we get into the summer and we have like 100 degree nights, this will be on high all night. Which is supposed to be able to do for eight hours. So that's good for me and Blue. And then it's rechargeable. So I'll link this stuff below if you guys want to try any of it. Is there a light on this? Stop. <gasps> Stop. There's a freaking light on it. <laughs> Sick. Okay. I'm gonna go hang this up in Rue. You guys can look at this. It's perfect. So I can point this down. And it can be on blue all night. What? I'm so excited. Really, we're like real deals now. I think people have to take us seriously now. I'm super excited for that. Okay, cool. What do you think, Pupper Lou? He only cares about his ball. Got it. Okay, well, as you guys can see, the sun is setting. Blue, you hit the camera. <laughs> How rude. So, uh, I guess let's go have our first night in Rue in this new summer setup. Shall we? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Okay. tonight on the menu is a natural five inch filled bone artificial peanut butter flavored so blue loves these things all right get back get back lay down how do you like your little gel pad is it cute take it Mish gangsta. You know what I really need to get for Rue is a hot spot. I really need to look into that because that's something that would be so useful for me sitting here right now. Like I could edit videos all night and then upload them while I sleep. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't have to go into town to go to coffee shops anymore. I really, I need to look up into that. What was I just doing? I had a point, but I forgot it. No, 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 no. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> it's kind of funny because I have this light up here and all the bugs are on the windshield around it. Stay out, suckas. You ain't allowed in. It's kind of funny that I'm like deathly afraid of bugs, but yet I choose to live outdoors for my life. Interesting. All right. Let's head back. I don't know how well you guys can see back there, but now that I'm in bed, the, the two things that I will say is I probably am not going to use this setup unless it's super hot out. I'm talking like 90s during the day and like 70s at night because, I mean, this is super nice, but it's like chilly. You know what I mean? Like this isn't really necessary right now. Like I kind of thought it would be. So definitely saving this for 
for hotter nights, but that's gonna be like amazing in July and August. Like this is gonna come in clutch for sure. I can already tell. Two, my feet hang off the end of the bed, which is amazing. Like you think that sounds scary, but actually I'm kind of cramped in here sometimes at night. So I feel like I'm really gonna like that and get good sleep tonight, so. Both positives. I'm gonna go to sleep and see how it actually functions and everything. Blue seems happy as a clam. So he's loving his mat, he's loving his bone. But anyways, I just edited for like three hours and I'm exhausted, so I'm gonna go to bed. We'll see you guys in the morning. Hey, Ruby. Let's go. Get up. It was awesome. It's definitely going to save us this summer. I'm definitely going to be pulling that bad boy out anytime it's like 65 and up at night. So, first night went well. All right. I got to I got to go get coffee and wake up. So, I'm going to let you guys go. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.